where my little greenhouse is. I've got a little bit of barrel ponics going. Um, inside the shed is our storage and what I call the breeding room where we've got some fish tanks. Um, I've only got one breeding fish tank going. Haven't been very successful with that. I think it's because our, our well water is super, super hard and high in pH. But I'm not putting a lot of energy into being successful. Um, and you're going to be talking about that tomorrow or Monday? Monday. All right. Tomorrow. I'll be there on Monday. Fish, Tomorrow's fish Mother's fish Day, tomorrow, so right? I won't be listening tomorrow. How many people will not be here on Monday, by the way? How many people will not be here? One. All right. Really? That's good. That's good. Cool. Cool. Cool, because they kind of had John right at the end. Oh, yeah. like, yeah. So we're, we're going to start leave. out up here. Um, we'll just walk over there. I'll let you guys just kind of wander around. I'll talk really loud so everybody can hear while you're checking things out. It's pretty tough here and down below because there's so many people to, and it, it's narrow. So everybody's just going to have to kind of file and check things out. Um, and then down there we're going to divide into thirds um so you'll you'll plant you'll pot up you'll you'll plant some seeds um and i mean it's it's, it's going to be pretty minimal so everybody will probably do a few little things and then we'll go some people will go and look at the system while others transplant um and you know it'll probably be five or six each you know which is enough just to do a little bit but that's where we're at um i just wanted to share i know you had this is the, the, it's called Wholesale Success. Um, it's from familyfarmed.org. I just picked it up yesterday from one of those uh, North Coast Opportunities, one of those nonprofit places. They gave it to me. It's a $70 manual. And I've just looked through it and it looks, it's incredible. It's full pictures, um, how to set up your harvesting area. Um, they've got like, basically pictorial farm tours of like five different farms, different containers, um, just like here's cucumbers, weight and sizes, carton sizes, <laughs> diameter, length, storage, pests and diseases, harv um, harvesting, handling and packing. I mean, this is all information I've been trying to figure out for a couple of years. You know, I wish someone would have just went like that. It's definitely worth and 70 bucks. Absolutely, and you know, I'm part of this advisory group, and you know, they've got business people and council members and buyers and distributors and farmers all trying to figure out how how to create a distribution hub in our area. I mean, you can see Willits and Ukiah are like the two main metropolitan areas in our county in the inland, and then you've got Fort Bragg, and so there, it's a very dynamic, uh, unique place to figure it out. So. They're trying to figure out how to make it work for everyone. And one of the things I keep trying to beat home is educate the farmers. Ed I, I needed education on how to pack, how to set my farm up so I'm not hauling things up and down the hill. You can see what I'm talking about now. Um, how, to, how, how to handle things like a business. If you educate the farmers, then the farmers are gonna be able to sell their stuff. If farmers are just growing stuff and don't know how to do business, they're throwing their stuff to the chickens. So um, it, it's very important. This is really valuable. And any type of education you could get, any groups, <coughs> anything is, is pretty invaluable. Where did you get that? Did you order, they they did gave you it to it? me. You can order it. From yeah. who? Um, Familyfarmed.org. If you Google Family Farm okay. and Wholesale Success Catalog or Manual, it'll It'll pop up. It came right up. I looked for it yesterday. Yeah. It came right up on the internet. Like, buy it now. Yeah. Okay. yeah. And I'll be giving one to you. Just what you read on cucumbers? I need that. Yeah. 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 I need that. Yeah. Well, last, last, let's see, Monday, less than a week ago, we sold 30 cases of cucumbers. Tuesday, 22 came back because they were wilted. Because the previous week had been pretty hot in our greenhouse. And, and picking them with that field heat on them, they didn't, when they went to the cooler, they wilted. They were just too hot when we picked them. You can't pick a cucumber that's 115 degrees and expect it to last. And I saw in the contents here, there's something just about all the different types of cooling. Um, one of the big distributors in the Bay Area is variable vegetable. They require that you hydro cool. Yes. What's hydro cooling, you know? like Ice water. So, yeah, or, you know, the yeah, industrial, yeah, they'll yeah, wrap yeah. it up in plastic and then just spray it for an hour, you know, with cold water. I mean, and that's expensive. But 
you know, I didn't know, but this manual tells you all about it. So, um, so we can walk over that way, and we'll... Everybody, or you want to go? No, I, I think we'll, we'll start everybody up here, and then we'll, we'll go down and Rotate try and through. break 